if I had to found without the MC being there first, Cam's is gonna be so upset, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Was it was it Fuyu was it Fuyuhiko? Fuyu Fuyuhiko hated the shit out of her. Not my hero. No one panicked. It was just my hero. Wait, that mask. I mean, Akane had blood on her. There's no way Akane would have killed her, right? Epic. No, <laughs> what? When did I? When did I begin dreaming? That was the same way as the game was. Well, Fuyuhiko hates everyone equally, though. But I mean, he always—he was the one always calling her a bitch and shit. Who was she again? You don't remember her? I'm playing the game with good friendly. What's up, bro? Yeah, this is the first time I'm playing the game, so if you are new here and you are just watching, just please try not to spoil anything for me. Appreciate it. I couldn't understand anything that was in front. What's good though, Crimson? And friendly. Hope you guys are having a good day. That's wild, bro. I was not expecting. No, Julius, I don't remember. Generic anime redhead number 43. Bro, she's the girl that, she's the photographer. She was the photographer that was taking all the pictures and shit. She don't believe in anything. Well, cheers to this, I guess. It's not, it's not Pecco, so. Cheers to this. Why the fuck is Monokuma so- Yo, shut up, Sabo! The ultimate photographer. She had an unyielding force of personality, but she was act actually very good at taking care of people. Yo, Cam's- oh, Bro, hold on, bro. Is Cam's lurking? He is. Is he streaming? Who followed? Friendly, friendly lesbian. Appreciate the follow, man. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you. It means a lot for me. Appreciate you. Towards us and toward herself, she was always facing forward. She was that kind of person. Why her? Why my hero? Why? Why did this happen to her? The muscles in my face stiffened and my hair grew hard. Darkness clouded my vision. My legs started to wobble. I stiffly placed my hand against the wall. Hey, Hajime. Before this, we were having a great time, right? We were excited about going to the beach. We were having a lot of fun. But why? Why did something like this happen? Someone tell me. I actually don't know what's going on either. Bro, th this is this is bad too. This, she wasn't bad, but I didn't really like her. She was okay. Like I didn't hate her. She was, yeah, she was more a little more forceful. I didn't hate her. But this is bad. Because our detectives, fucking my hero, a good detective in the first one, Biakio, you know, Biakio being Biakio. Those are two good detectives gone. I did, bro. She was annoying, in my opinion. She was, I mean, she was okay. It's okay. You instantly left the beach house. What's up, Dino? How you doing, bro? I'm sure it took some time for everyone else to come here. So they had to change and whatnot. It must have taken some time. But I didn't really know how much time had passed. My senses were numbed. My emotions were also numbed. Within me, various layers were peeling off. My senses started to return around the time I realized that the others were already here. Huh? What the hell is this? <laughs> Why am I hero? The girls were standing outside the door, leaning to the beach, their faces pale with terror. Like this. For heaven's sake, what in the world's going on? Their pale faces still intact, the girls began wobbling toward the beach house, until a voice stopped Hold them. It. Hold on a sec. Mm. Those beneath you, be careful not to step on them. What? Beneath? See? You know, the footprints in the front of that door. These are footprints leading outside the beach house. That's probably, the, probably an important clue. What do you think the killer is? I don't know. I mean... I'm always, always, I'm always gonna be, like I said, don't spoil anything for me. This is all rhetorical. I always, I always have that intent and that feeling of Fuyuhiko. 
He's always got to be a suspect because he's him. Akane because she had the blood. But this was just first impressions. Akane because she had the blood on her. Unless Nekumaru can vouch for her that they were fighting. And then... And then Hiyoko because she ran away from this. So... Huh? If you mean evidence. Malakuma mentioned at the announcement, right? After a certain amount of time, we will hold a class trial. Another class trial? Serious? And are you saying this is... That's right! One of you guys killed her! Killed? That's impossible! Solid verdict's guess is very logical. Crazy how Monokuma is behind all this. Also, who's small enough to have those footprints? Yeah, like I said, Hiyoko is also a possibility, so... Hey, hey! It's not like an accident or something. I mean, she might have came in and then ran away, because she likes me. She likes her a lot, but... We'll see. We'll see as time comes. Like. All right, how y'all doing? I'm chilling, bro. I'm chilling. If you think that's an accident, that still means his death was caused by someone else's actions, that right? That also counts as a legitimate murder. No such deep deaths fall into a gray area on this island. We'll make sure that it's clear to you guys. This island dying from sickness is basically the only death that's not considered a murder. <laughs> well, it's impossible not to get sick and die on this island when Bon and me take such good care of people. Oh, speaking of which, like there it is, the silent treatment attack. This is like the number one thing that hurts me. Well, fine, I'm not going to lose your bash. I decided to become a tough kid. This is the worst. Once again, this is a horrible nightmare. Another victim, and it's all because of Monokuma. No Jeez, it's not my fault. Then whose fault is it, you ask? Yippee! To find out, we hold the class trial. So... Let's begin already. No whining, just begin already. It's the Monokuma! It's a Monokuma file! Now then, do your best to investigate. I'll see you later at the class trial. <laughs> I'd stay, but I don't want spoilers on this. I just came by to say what's up. Haven't checked the streams in a while. You good, Dino. I know people want to play this and they don't want to get spoiled. Completely understand that, so I appreciate you, bro. Hey! You should have stopped the murder before it occurred. Don't you have that kind of power? <laughs> That I did have the power before he appeared, uh -huh. even if she tried to stop it. Judging from Monokuma and Monami's relationship, there's no doubt she'd get stepped on by herself. <laughs> Monokuma took everything away, including the magic stick and the surveillance cameras. The only thing I can rely on are these ears, but they can only hear a person about three times that of a normal person. Basically. You have no idea what's happening on the island in the first place. <laughs> I'm just the worst. A powerless rabbit like me is the worst. Yeah, I'll catch y'all next time. Appreciate you, Dinah. You know, it's not time to focus on something like that. More importantly, what should we do? We have to do we have to do it again? The cruel thing we have to do it again. Why? Cannot believe it. My hero was killed by one of us. Damn it! Yeah, I can't do this anymore. Investigating the class trial. Seriously, I'm done. Everyone feels the same, but we can't do anything else except do it. And there's no way we can just ignore the reason my hero was killed. Hey. The only thing we can do is investigate. I'm so glad Chiaki's still alive. Nagito's my favorite. He's still tied up. Cause it's bad. Cause we should never forgive that. Killing is something we should never forgive. Chiaki. Well? Killer has their reasons. I understand that. It was the same for Taro Taro too. It's all really Monokuma's fault. I understand that too, but even so, we should never forgive I'm killing. I had her head in the clouds, so for her to say something like that, she probably can't forgive this at all. Well, that's true of me too. Understood. Regardless, everyone is gonna die if we don't do it. In order for us to survive, we must do it. There's my girl, Pekko. I'm gonna do it! And let's do this. Perhaps. Probably wants us to do this too. She wanna to reveal the truth behind her death. <laughs> I understand if everyone's doing it, I'll do it too, but please give me a little time. Please give me the time to calm myself down. Also, I'll go and tell the others who aren't here about this. You're right. If you heard about the announcement, you won't know where the murder took place. <laughs> Alright, we need Mikan. We need Mikan to fucking investigate the body again. And let's begin. Who killed my hero Kozuimi? Why was she killed? We gotta find out and solve this already. That's right, we have to do it. It's the only way. But is Hiyoko strong enough to kill someone with a baseball bat? And she's the only one that really liked me. Uh, me hero that like that, so. You're finna feel despair? Shut up! Let me figure it out. Dead. Estimated time of death is around 3 p.m. So that was about the time we got to the diner. And we didn't see... And we saw Hiyoko later, so it can't be Hiyoko. Unless she stood there. 
I think the crime is where the body was discovered. It's inside the beach house at Chandler Beach. The victim, uh, the cause of the single killing blow to the head with a blunt instrument. There are no other conspicuous external injuries and no trace of foreign substances such as drugs. Around 3 p.m., that's the time Kazuichi and I arrived at the diner. Yo, shut up, Angel. If we had just gone to the beach house instead, now now's the time to feel regret. I need to focus on doing as much as I can right now. And then I'm going to find out the truth behind Mahuyo's death. That's the only way the rest of us can survive. Yo, Dino, yo, calm down, bro. Yo, I appreciate that, man. The five gifted. I'm just kidding, I'm not gonna do it. Sobs! Appreciate it, buddy. For real though, Dino, I appreciate you, man. Thank you, my guy. He didn't have to do that, man. That's 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 insane, bro. Appreciate you. Dino, rich, rich. This song right here, legend. Sorry, I'm sorry. I had to. Ah, you're back. I had to. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thanks for the gift, it's soft. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Much love, guys. I appreciate you, Dino. Thank you. For real, man. Might still be things I haven't investigated yet. I see. I'll never forgive killing, hmm. However. Chiaki seemed quite different from her usual self. She must feel very strong about killing. That, it's just not Chiaki. There's no way anyone would forgive something like that. I guess you're right. She's lost all of her life and body. It's as if she's a shell. Three months badge. Let's go. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that nice red and blue. That red, I think I think the three month one is one of my favorites. That and the one year. I think those ones look the best. I see her laying in front of me, but I still can't believe it. I can't connect this lifeless body to the high spirit in my hero. But we don't have time to wallow in sentiment. There's no way I can just stand here. I slap both my hands on my cheeks and face my hero's body one more time. Lean against the beach house door that leads to the road. If she leaned onto the door like this, it would have been impossible to open. Maybe my hero tried to run away when she has tapped and cried across the door. Evidence can be seen the blood stains on the floor. There was shrieked as if she crawled through them. She used all of her energy to crawl away and leaned against the door and took her last breath. We're gonna sue this guy for copyright infringement. <laughs> for someone as headstrong as her to run, she must have felt really desperate. This investigation song, it, I will tell you right now, it is much better than the first one. It is much better than the first one. Hmm? What's this? Is this a mask? Did someone bring this toy from the toy section of the supermarket? Maybe party goods, regardless why this is even here. Did the killer want to conceal their face? No, they totally stand out. I mean, it's such a gaudy mask. Um, a gaudy mask? Huh? That mask! You've seen this? Sunwitch Esperito. It is a super fun anime with a viewership surpassing 90% in my country. An anime that has a viewership over 90% is Sunny's country really alright? Could it be? Was that mask placed next to her body? It's true, could it be? Could it be what? I am sorry. Please give me some time. For some reason, I know Sonia rushed out of the beach house. What's with her? It looks like she knows something. If that's the case, I shall wait until she dies to talk about it. If Sonia to be so worked up, it must be something big. I wonder what she knows. <laughs> Working on it right now. Yo, appreciate it, buddy. That's weird. What do you mean? Uh, I want to calm myself a little, so I thought about getting a drink from that refrigerator. When I opened it a few days ago, I'm pretty sure there was a larger variety of drinks. Man. Guess I'm just imagining things. I mean, who cares about drinks right now, huh? What are you talking about? Seriously, it's okay. I've resolved it on my own, so just drop it. The heck, you started it. According to the Monokuma file, the fatal blue was dealt with the blunt object. Is that the metal bat right there? Metal bat. Yep. Same as the Twilight Syndrome murder case. Well, There's a girl named Girl E who was killed by the game during the fourth day. Um, girl was killed with a blow from a metal bat, just like my hero. That is a real life picture of a real life girl. 
What? Hey, hey. I don't even say that shit, bro. Bro, you used to say that shit, and then I started saying it, bro, and then you stopped. All right. Red blood. Yeah, it's not. It's, yo, it's not censored. Monka W. Monka W, bro. Mad respect. A country full of weaves, honestly. Yeah, that's exactly it, but did you play it too? And I'm sure you know this, but this case is strongly connected to the Twilight Syndrome murder case, I think. In order to solve the mystery behind my hero's death, you probably need to solve that game's mystery too. But even if you solve the game's mystery, all clues in it were lousy and useless. I mean, it started ambiguously, it was still ambiguous when it ended. That's wrong. Red-blooded, this economy blasphemy! Because you haven't beaten the game. Beaten? I finished the game with a game over, but you were able to beat it? Mm. I'm not the some gamer girl who talks about video games she's never beaten. So what am I supposed to do actually beat the B? Can't stop thinking about that for some reason. But for now, I should focus on the investigation. It's okay to say that with the male bat is absolutely a murder weapon, right? Oh, you think I know what those numbers mean, bro? I don't know. Not only that, the only drink left in here either sweetened or colored. They look unhealthy. Hey, those are clues out the trash can. That's what I thought, but there's only a bunch of empty plastic bottles. I don't see anything that looks like a clue. I might be still things that. Okay. So this is the shower room. The shower's being repaired so water won't come out. What about how hot water? Well, that's impossible tea. Yo, cat jam, bro. This is a cat jam. The shower is out of the order. It doesn't waste of space. I'm sorry. Just when I was planning to fix it, my magic stick was taken from me. So I never got around to fixing it. Heck, what does your magic have to do with pairing it? You're so evil. It's all Monokuma's fault. Everything's all Monokuma's fault. Ooh. Your doubtful eyes are telling me you think I'm Monokuma's accomplice. You must have run my mind. Pick what you want of me, I've already given up. Let me tell you this one more time. As long as you guys work together, you should be able to stand against any kind of despair. I promise I will help with that. It's 11037. Leon, no! <laughs> Leon, no! This is too weird. Something this weird should only happen in song lyrics. Cause the door is half open. The last time I came in here, that wasn't the case. It's a little suspicious. You're probably investigating inside here too. Bam, bam, bam. The first game. In the first game, um, the first case, um, the basically the person, the victim, they wrote one one zero three seven on the board or uh, behind them on the wall, and if you flipped it over, it said Leon. So. But there's so much crap on the shelves before only one person can stand in there. If you think about it this way, it means possible for only one person to stay in here. This yellow thing is a gummy candy. Oh, Hyoko, you're looking like it. Oh, Hyoko. A lot of stuff jammed on the shelves, even surfboards and surfboard cases. Yoko! Bam, 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 down, doo, doo, doo. Or maybe she went here with my hero and she hid in the closet because she heard somebody and then she ran. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. What am I missing? What am I missing?
To bludgeon someone with a baseball bat? I mean, still, bro. My hero was also killed by a blow from a metal bat. There's an incident related to a Twilight Syndrome murder case. What happened to the drinks in the refrigerator? I just said it's okay. I resolved on my own. I see. However... My well, yeah, Sayaka so died first because they were the first characters the creators made and they were based for all other characters' designs. The developers started hating looking at them for some reason and decided to kill them off first. That's fucked! Leon was such a cool character when he was... What? what? Leon was a cool-ass character. What am, I, what am I missing in here? I've talked to everybody. I don't think I should talk to you. How suspicious. It's suspicious, I think. Can you find some kind of clue? You know, the footprints from earlier? They were in the front of the entrance facing the beach, right? Well... Hajime and Kazuichi footprints show that you guys were the first ones to go inside the beach house. But these footprints are just the opposite. They're coming out of the beach house. Hey. Now you mentioned I thought those footprints were strange, too. Uh. First, I tried to go into the beach house from the floor facing the road. But it didn't open, so I went around trying to go in from the beach house door. I couldn't go inside the door because my hero's body was blocking it, right? Mm. And that's when I noticed these footprints. Footprints leading from the beach house to the tunnel look they look like they belong to one person. Someone's footprints leading out of the beach house. That's pretty definitely suspicious. Mm. Sayaka was excusable by Leon. Honestly, bro. Leon was so cool. I liked Leon as a character. Yeah. Fortunately, I went swimming to scout out the first beach. I don't know, I don't know anything about this beach. Maybe. Is that really true? But still. Yo, why, why, yo, why is Soda always excusing fucking? He's always fucking suspecting Pecco. Fuck off! These footprints lead straight from the beach house to the tunnel. Huh. Since I was swimming at the beach, of course my footprints would lead from shore to the tunnel. Huh? And whose footprints are these? It appears. It's no mistake that these are the killer's footprints, but I have no clue who that might be. Well, for now, it's obvious that this is a clue, don't you think? Yeah, I'm gonna do the trial today. I'm gonna do the trial today. I'm gonna solve the mystery behind you. You probably need to solve that game's mystery too. Hey, what type of game was the original? I don't know if this is a clue or not, but I guess I should explain it. Final Syndrome is an adventure game series. The first one was released in 1966. 96. It's about a group of high school girls who are exploring. Okay. Do you remember? Yeah, you're right. In this series, there were games, three games were released until the year 2000. <laughs> when 2008, a completely new game was released. As a fan, I was really happy. It even kept the same ambiance and gameplay as before. Other than that, a live action movie was also made based on the game's original story. It's not really a forgotten series like Monokuma claimed, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, I guess that's about it. Yep. What am I missing? Oh, right here. There's blood stains on the floor and the No, that's not it. Did I miss something in the closet? I don't think so. The question is, where the hell did they get that middle baseball bat from? What am I missing? Yep. Oh. Okay. Hey, yo, why'd you get in here? Damn it. Guess no one's in here. I'll think the killer was hiding in here after they failed to escape. It wouldn't be that easy. There's a window. It's small, but maybe you can crawl out of it somehow. Probably doesn't mean if someone could crawl through it. I can't seem to take my mind off it. It was really high, so that window is also situated at a very high place. 
so high that even if I stretch my hand out, I can't reach it. It's probably about nine feet up. It's not that. It's just an iron barred window, if that's the case. What? Are you still thinking about that window? Yeah, I was thinking the killer might have escaped through there. Leave it to me. I got it. I'll pitch in and help you out. Now then. Give me a piggyback ride. I'll check the window for you. Pitching and help. It feels like I'm the one who's getting pitching in and helping. I'll pick you up. If you don't hurry, I'll punch you. Kill Indus. No matter what I say, it's not gonna matter. Fine, I'll just leave it to you. <laughs> don't worry, my panties are clean. Hey, yellow sign. I see. That's good. I let out a deep sign that bent over under the window. All right. All right. As she shouted, I'm I jumped onto my shoulders. Uh. <laughs> oh, why is she not giving us a piggyback ride? Hey, your balance, your balance sucks. sucks. Make sure your stance is wider. Y you, you're a lot heavier than I expected. <laughs> you're a lot heavier than I expected. Yeah, because I'm so buff. Like, every time I get a massage, they tell me I'm just a mass of muscles. A massage, huh? Do you have a trainer or something since you're the ultimate gymnast? <laughs> Bro, he's like passing out. Nah, I don't have a trainer. My stepmom's lovers like to get drunk and give me full body massages. Ew! Oh, okay, so he was, she was being abused. Cause see, I remember when she was telling us when we were talking to her that they make her do weird things. Ugh. I shouldn't have asked. So, how's the window? Let's see. Hmm. That's what happened. D did you find anything? Well, since there's this iron bar, I was pretty sure no one would be able to get through the window. But check it out. Ch check it out? Hold on. I'll give it a try. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you make bro? This guy's about to pass out. The guy on my shoulders like cranked my neck so high that I started to worry. This iron bar ain't even pinned down. Looks like you can open and close it pretty easy. See? My head can fit through, no problem. Then it's not impossible to go in and out of that window? Yep, yep. I jumped on my shoulders and flashed a wide grin. <laughs> Isn't this a big discovery? The problem is, how are they able to reach that window? Mm. Even if I jumped, I can't really reach it. <laughs> well, if two people work together like us, it wouldn't be a problem, right? If that's the case, that would mean the killer had an accomplice. Huh? Accomplice? Sounds like a big word. Is that the name of a kung fu master? Even if there was an accomplice, the person acting as a step stool would be in step like still be inside. Yeah, just one person could get out of here without help, right? Really? So, like, I got it. a freaking ninja could do it, you know? A ninja can climb fences or walls, no problems, right? Just as a thought, it looks difficult to go in and out of the, through that window. <laughs> the heck, I even took the time and led you by wisdom. Piss me off. You're the one who said it was suspicious, so I took the time to pitch it out. You. It was such a waste of time to help you out. All you saw were my panties. No, I didn't. <laughs> oh, well, it's not like it's the end of the world. I'm telling you, I didn't look at them. There's still not enough. Just from the clues here, I don't think I have enough to find the truth. So I can try investing that again to find out why my hero got killed. Girl, he was killed in the game by a single blow from a metal bat. Metal bat, that's the same weapon that was used to kill my hero. There's no way that this is just a coincidence, right? Actually, the game is the theme is a missing link. You know, it's a re recurring theme for mysteries, right? It's kind of like a hidden connection. A missing link, if that's the killer's motive for the killing time. And that mister must be hidden inside that game. I should ask her about it. Hey, yo, congratulations, Angel. You just wasted your points. Congrats, dickhead. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 bam. Hey, Chiaki, okay, that's something I want to ask you. Are you okay right now? Are you done investigating already? Huh? I think I've finished investigating once thoroughly. Yep. Now let's go. Go. So, you want to know about the Twilight Syndrome, right? Now I think you should act, actually play go. yourself, so let's go. Yeah, you're right. I left the beach house and headed over to the Jabberwock Park where the unsettling arcade machine was placed, but I never I never expected that person to be waiting there. Is that Fuyuhiko? 
Probably for you, Hiko. Ah! Oh, what are you doing? Hello there. Hi, Dr. Shaka. I'm glad you guys are doing well. Nagito? <laughs> Feels like it's been a long time since I was able to talk to you two like this. Even though we haven't spoke for just a few days. Why? Why are you here? Whoa. Well, there's no need to worry about a loser like me. <sighs> More importantly, did you hear? Apparently my hero got killed this time. Jeez, how horrible. She was the heart of our group, always spirited and very eager to talk. For her to be killed, if only I could have taken her place, I would have gladly done it. Amazing. Well, you still guys will be able to shine because this outcome is full of despair, right? This guy is so weird. Why is he so weird? I hate the I hate I hate when he talks. That's right. No matter how dark the despair, hope can shine much brighter and stronger. Mm. Looks like you feel no remorse. Jesus, usually he's acting so crazy, he's almost pissing me off. So why are you here? Who told you about my hero? Now, now. Not to make that scary face. I'll tell you no. Monami. It's Monami. Yes, it was me. That's his charm. I don't see no charm. Hey, why did you untie Nagito without anyone's permission? Um, did I do bad? I just want everyone to get along and, you know, cooperate. There's no way we'll get along. You already know what kind of guy he is. But fighting for among friends is what Monokuma wants you to do. To do. Now, now. Monami is making a valid point, too. You have no right to say that. But now's not the time for friends to fight. There's going to be a clash out from a hero, right? That's right. That's why everyone must work together to have Monokuma. Enough. Enough already. Just go away already. <laughs> Understood. Yeah, why are we so mean to her? Nagito, you two, hurry up and get lost. Man. I'm a little lonely, but I guess I'll do that. I already saw the true ending of that game, so there's really no reason for me to be here. Now then. So although I might be a little late, I too will do some investigating for a while. I'll try to be useful in my own way. Mm. Who do you want to be useful to, the killer or us? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? I'll do my best on the side, I hope. The more I talk to him, the creepier he gets. The more I listen to him, the more I don't understand him. If didn't exist, the situation would be a lot easier to deal with. Damn it. Hey, hey. Let's just move on and start the game. You're right. If I do play this, I might get, get him over again. Before I start, I should ask Shiaka if there's a walkthrough for this game. Can I ask you something? Is there a walkthrough for this game? Huh? I think it's gonna repeat the second day and fourth day again and game over. There's a walkthrough you can tell me about? Well, when you get a game over, that's the walkthrough. What do you mean? Want me to tell you? I want me to tell you? I'll tell you if you want. There's a hidden command. Hidden command? See? You should have seen it too. You know the thing that was played on the game over screen. Is that... You're talking about the message that says down five? That's right. Just so you know that doesn't mean down five drinks or something. It means you have to press down five times. The hidden command is, you have to press the down button five times when you're on the title screen. If you do that, you should be able to get the real game. So that's a trick, just expect you're the ultimate gamer. It doesn't have anything to do with being a gamer. This is just you gays or don't. In fact, Nagito got it on his own, so it looks like he managed to beat the game. Come on, give it a try. Press down five times on the title screen. All right, let's do it. One, two, three, four, five. Screen chase. She was right. This is the real game. Toronto Soldier Murder Case is Truth Edition. She started up. We need to find out what this motive is. with a specific murder case, a tragic killing that occurred within the grounds of the academy that the girls attended. Based on their understanding of the crime scene, the police ruled that the incident was the work of a pervert who snuck into the school grounds. However, there was a secret behind that incident. Even before the janitor discovered the body, there were students who, who witnessed the crime itself. The students were high, five high school girls. They didn't want to get involved with the incident, so they tried to hide the fact that they were had the first to discover it. However, the tragedy befell those girls. Several days after the incident, one of the five girls' girl, E, is murdered by someone. What in the world happened at this one peaceful academy? By playing the game the missing first day and third day, you will be able to understand that mystery. All the answers will you are to seek are hard hidden in this truth edition. Will you be able to reach the truth? Now then, let's start with first day when it all began. <clears throat> Holy shit. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry for keeping you all waiting. 
<clears throat> Jeez, we're gonna go home late because we gotta wait for a slowpoke girl A. Come on, girl B, you don't have to be that mad. Come on. Hey, don't go taking photos without permission. People might mistake us for good friends. Okay, hold on. I'll be right back. I really gotta piss again. That pissing legend is back at it, bro. Like I said, I drink a lot of wiglets, bro. I'll be right back. So the per so the girl taking photos of my hero friend. Keep that in mind. What? There's no way I'd ever be friends with a tra nasty, trashy pig shit like you. Girl B. Girl B is Hiyoko. Who is who the one that took the picture? Okay. Girl B is Hiyoko. The way girl B treats people, even loads lone sharks looking to collect would get sick to their stomachs. Girl, are you here yet? Apparently she forgot something. So it's just to wait a little longer. She can't find her school swimsuit. That's Sonia. Girl E Sonia. No. I'm so confused. Her swimsuit, huh? Maybe it got stolen? Stolen? You don't know a pervert has been spotted in the area recently. You should be super careful, girl A. A chubby weakly like you makes the perfect play. Stop it. Girl A is getting really scared. Fun to bully, girl A. What was that sound? Sound like a glass breaking. Sounds like it came from the second floor. Let's go. Girl E, what happened? I don't know. I was walked by the front of the music room just now. And then I suddenly heard the sound of a glass breaking. Is someone in there? Girl B is Hiyoko, yeah. And girl E. Girl E, she's the one that died, so it's gotta be. My hero. That's what I was thinking, but I think she, the door is locked, so I can't get it open. Build this bitch like a 2 by 4 You're right, it's locked. Did someone lock it from the inside? Is someone really in there? No, we use the key from the teacher's lounge, we can open this door, right? I'll go to the teacher's lounge and get the key to the music room. Teachers are probably gone by now, I'm sure we can bring the key in over in secret. I have a bad feeling about this. Found the key, nobody was there, so it was super easy to get. So let's open it right away. Okay. Girl, you lead the way. Me? Come on, hurry, hurry. Someone's laying on the floor. Girl A is Mekon. True, true. You right, you right. This girl has flustered social wreck like Mekon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want you right. Girl A would be Mekon. Girl B would be Hyoko. The one who took. Girl E is Mi Miharu. I think. He dead. Dead. That's impossible. Why? As long as your voice, they might still be nearby. Nearby? I mean, this looks like someone murdered her. Murdered, huh? Seriously, shut up. What's gonna happen if the killer notices us? What should we do? What should I do? I see, so that's what's happened. I found it. The killer's escape route. Could it be? Of course, obviously. The window's broken. The sound we heard from the entrance hall was probably the window breaking. Someone probably locked the music room door from the inside after killing this girl. Appreciate the follow, Crimson. Thank you, my guy. Appreciate you. Looks like she got hit by something when she died, but I can't seem to find anything, anything bloody here. What happened to the weapon? Did the killer take it? So the killer just ran out the window. But if they just wanted to run away, they could have opened the window. Why do they have to break it? They're probably trying to leave in a hurry. Looks, looks there, look, there's evidence. Fish tank by the window tipped over and all the gravel scattered. They must have accidentally tripped, tipped it over when they were frankly trying to get away. Broken fish tank. Why is this added to ours? It's not too high to jump for the second floor, so maybe they thought it'd be safer to use in the hallway. Is that really it? I mean, to lock the door, you'd have to either lock it from the inside in the music room or use the lounge key. When I went to the music room key, it was, a, it was in the teacher's lounge. The killer wouldn't have had time to return the key before they broke into the window. 
since the killer was inside the music room. Also, to get outside from the music room, they need to have a pass by us in the entrance hall. But we didn't see anyone pass by, which means the killer's only escape route was this window. Would have been our window too, right? Probably that pervert I heard about. He's the one who snuck inside the cool grounds. When they say pervert, they talk about soda. Soda one of the killed. Play a murder mystery in your game dating in your dating sim game. Honestly, bro. I couldn't find her anywhere. And the pervert who stole girls' East swimsuit was also murdered that girl over there. They probably locked the music room so they could rape her, but she ended up resisting. So they frantically tried to get away, broke the window, and escaped. Isn't it bad if we stay here much longer? I mean, if I don't want to get involved in something like this, and the killer might still be around, too. That's bad. Uber bad. We better hurry up and run. And then we have to report it to the police? Don't you know what happens when you report this kind of stuff to the police? You become the prime suspect just because you found the body first. I definitely don't want that. So that's probably what Hyoko was doing. She probably found the body and dipped, but she didn't want to be the first one to report it. Please wait, don't leave me. What's Girl D thinking about? Girl D. Sorry, did I make you wait? So what's up? You asked me to meet here. Don't you tell me you're gonna confess your love to me. Oh, what happened? I want to look at this photo. On the day of the incident, I found this when I peeked into the next door classroom as I was going home. Couldn't help taking a picture. What do you think these broken base, base pieces mean? That sound, that sound we heard from the entrance hall wasn't the sound of a window breaking. I don't know anything about this vase. <clears throat> if that's the case, the killer didn't escape from the window. <coughs> Seriously, I don't know anything. <clears throat> I'm choking on Doritos. Hold on. Jesus. It's okay. I made sure to throw it away. Huh? If you found it, you'd be in trouble, right, girly? Are you trying to blackmail me? Of course not. That's not what this is about. There's something you're hiding from me. I want you to say it. I mean, we're friends, right? You didn't say anything either. I knew you. I knew you knew. I knew that girl who got killed was tormenting you. <clears throat> no, she was just tormenting you. She was seriously making your life a living hell. That bitch was in your photography club back in the middle school, right? She was probably jealous of your talent, so she was supposed to be your best friend if you told me none of this would happen. Don't tell me you. That bitch thought she could do anything she wanted because of her family influence. Oh, so we gotta find out who girl E is, right? I just couldn't stand it anymore. <clears throat> oh, at first I tried to talk to her. <clears throat> well, that bitch started talking shit about how she'd target me next, so I felt something raged, and before I knew it, I was choking her. And then she lost consciousness, but things would have been worse if she woke up, so that's why I had to do something about it. That's... It's not my fault, or yours. It's all her fault. Girl, E. That bitch girl he was it? Where is she was with her on the day of the incident? Looks like she threw something away here. What was it? The hell is this photo? The vases? Could it be the sound of the breaking glass was actually this? If it wasn't, why did she try to secretly get rid of this? That bitch, what the hell did she do to my little sister? Oh Looks like I need to ask her a few questions, and if that bitch really did that. I'll never, I'll never forgive her. Huh? <clears throat> Looks like this is the end. That's right. That's the truth edition. The incident's first day and third day just depicted in it. Yep. Now you filled in all four events from the first to the fourth day. What do you think the characters in this game? I mean, like girl A and girl B, their names make no sense. They have no romantic chemistry either. 
See? Look, the ending started rolling. Staff roll. Perhaps. Sure, they'll find out what you want to know if you look at that, probably. Supervisor Monokuma. Plant slash scenario Monokuma. Programmer Monokuma. Graphics Monokuma. Sound Monokuma. Cast. Who's the Euro? It's pure user plan. I think I would, if I would hear the words that bitch that much. Yeah, honestly, wait, just now. See? I didn't tell you wanna you wanna know who's gonna be on there. Miracle! Miracle, congratulations! You finally beat the Twilight Central murder case. <laughs> now you guys have played this game too, and you should already know. Ah! It was a non-fiction game based on an actual past incident. Is that By true? Non-fiction means original story based on historical facts or records. Hey, answer my question. Yeah. Even if this is non-fiction, you guys probably don't remember it. Well that can't be helped. That's what I'm saying, two koozie euros. So guy F's gotta be uh Fuyuhiko, right? That's school life. Alright, congratulations. Oh, is that their school life? Now that that's for the ending prize that I'm supposed to give you a royal for playing the game. I won't give it to you. Ending prize. There's only one ending prize, I already gave it to the first person who beat it. How disappointing. Did you say ending prize? I was told the same thing when I beat it too. Aww. I was too late. If I knew something like that was gonna happen, I would have played this game sooner. It was, yeah, because he had the envelope. Yeah, ending prize. That was um, what the fuck's his name? Is it Fuyuhiko? I think it's Fuyuhiko. Well, it was connected to that issue this time too. So what I'm getting from this is Fuyuhiko killed Fuyuhiko killed um Mahiru. Yeah, he did mention his little sister. So Fuyuhiko's little sister. Yeah, he mentioned in the diner. Talking about his little sister. And if he found out the truth that Mahiru was the one that choked her to death. That's something crazy actually possible? What do they do to us? I think there's something on your mind. How come we probably the thing that everyone else has beaten this game? This game is non-fiction. That existed in our forgotten missile memories. We gotta focus on solving this mystery first. We believe it's the most it's moment or not. It's clear that a murder did occur. If that's the case that I need to question them directly. If I do that, I might be able to learn something. I'll go to two. Hey, hey. <laughs> Ask them how it feels to be characters of the game. Leave it to me. If you want to gather your thoughts about the content of the game, talk to me anytime. We gotta ask Puyi Hiko. We meet again. <clears throat> Time is too perfect. You were waiting here, weren't you? You caught me? So you caught me. Wouldn't it be best if we travel together? If you still be in the game, we must think similarly, yeah. right? No, maybe I'm being a little too cold, conceited. A guy like me thinking similarity to you guys? <clears throat> it's okay, just make your point. Well... <clears throat> there was an airport on the first hour, right? I told you them to meet up here. I told them to meet up there. Them. You don't know? Well, the characters who appeared in the Twilight Syndrome murder case, of course. The girl must be busy with their investigations, too. It'd be a waste of time if we both question them now. Bye now. You come with me, I'll go on ahead and make with you guys. What should we do? Mm -hmm. The thing we can do is go. I guess you're right. Hiko didn't decide to show up. Hazume, over here. And Buki Hiyoko are all here. 
Names on the staff roll for the Switch Room, in case we're... Sumiki, Koizumi, Sayo Niji, Miyota, Sato, and Kuzuru. Wow. So he wanted a Fuyiko to come too, but he locked himself in his cottage and it wouldn't come out for me. Sorry. So unfortunately, he's absent. It's probably because I'm so incompetent and I apologize. What? Hey, to be absent, I thought you said it'd be good actually if we didn't come. I should kill you. <laughs> you said Monokuma had something important to tell us, right? We came because you told us that. <laughs> Sorry, that was a lie. A lie? You tricked us. What the? What the heck? Jeez. Fine, then I'm leaving. Wait. Can you wait? Can you, can you wait until we finish our business with you, right, Hajime? This is like on the same team as Na Naito. Not fair. Maybe we actually tricked us into coming to this place. Huh. We're not the same food to regular people like you. She's right, that might, that might be a regular guy, but I also have an ultimate talent, or at least I should have one. Hey, do you have a minute? There's something I want to ask you. Have you played Twilight Central Murder Case, Mikan? Um, no, since we said we weren't going to play that game. Also, I'm not really good at video games. I'm pretty slow and I panic instantly. I'm pretty sure the girl light character was like that, too. Hey, hey. You mind about your relationship with my hero? <laughs> relationship with my hero? I met her and when we first gathered at the classroom with everyone else, and after arriving at the alleyway, I did have a few conversations with her, but... Could it be? Did my hurry hate me? That's definitely it. She hated me. Doesn't know anything. No, it's not like she doesn't remember anything. But even though she hated me for her actually inviting me... For her actually inviting me, she must have been a really kind person. Bye. Remind me... A hero invited me this morning. This morning? She looked very serious and she was wondering if we could all meet up with so she could discuss something. But I already had plans to go to the beach, so I had to decline because I needed to prepare for that. And when she did, she made this lonely face and said that she'll reschedule for another day. <laughs> but only if I went with her, this wouldn't have happened. Why are you inviting me, Gon? Why? Hey, Buki, can I ask you something? Yeah, Bring it on. Can you play Twilight Syndrome Murder Case? Aww. That's a computer game, right? I'm basically off all those. Yeah. Buki's a tough girl, so I don't. I don't. Wait, I don't touch anything powered by electricity except electric guitars. Pretty sure that's a lie, but now that's the time not to really do on something like that. Your unique and tone and hyper energy. There was a character like that in the game too. <laughs> you mean that in a perverted way? No, in a normal way. Aww. You mean you ask me that? Buki's encounter with me here was hmm. Oh. I'm here this morning to go to the beach with us. She made this real disappointing face. Yeah, but she disappointed varies depending on the person Ibuki associates with in the apartment store rooftops. Let's stay focused on Mahiro. That's totally it! Turns out Mahiro had some business too, and she wanted to invite me to that instead. I was thinking about meeting with everyone, but if you already have plans. You know what she meant by everyone? Aww. Nope, didn't ask. I see. Ibuki, why? I see. Looks like we obtained some pretty valuable testimonies based on that. She's that Mahiro also beat that game. Why do you know that? You don't know? If she hadn't, she wouldn't have chosen these people to talk to. If she beat the game, she talked to the people who appeared in that game. <laughs> That's like what we're doing right now. Still. But in her case, with much, with much more serious probably. I mean, she was forced to learn that she was involved in that game. That's true. Mm. I'm surprised. I never thought my hero would play that game. It's true, that was unexpected. Can you attempt her into playing that game? Huh? What? I remember. <laughs> Did she, did she, did she, wait, did she leave saying she has some business to take care of? Wait, you tempted her, right? Just like you did to me. How mean. Tempt? That's a rude thing to say. No, that's That's wrong. a disrespectful, that's disrespectful toward my hero. No, that's wrong. Isn't that right? There's a way her feelings would change just because of a useless guy like me who tempted her. At the time, she was already considering giving that game a try. All I did was give her a little push. It's obvious. That's all I was. What the heck? Well... More importantly, is it better if we listen to what she has to say? Being quiet as ever. Can't hug you, Hiyoko. Hey. If my hero spoke to everyone who, who appeared in the game, she would have talked to you too, right? Well, Hiyoko. <laughs> she never talked to me at all. That's weird. Man, what a surprise. I didn't expect you to ask me such an easy question. Bye. So I'm just gonna go back to my cottage now. Yeah, hey, Hiyoko. No, my voice, Hiyoko, ran away as though she were avoiding me. <laughs> Looks like it's okay she ran away. Yeah, she's clearly suspicious. That's pretty much decided. Decided? Now then. Regardless, 
It looks like we're finished here, so why don't we part ways for now? There's still something I need to investigate. Bye now. I'll see you again later. Hey, that is his problem. Even his exit was pushy. What should we do now? Should we go back to the scene of the crime one more time and investigate? Very important to investigate the scene of the crime, but let's go over my hero's cottage first. If you beat that game, it's better we investigate there, I think. See? She might have that. Oh, the ending prize. If that's the case, I'll go with you. You're okay with that, right? Mm. Uh, that's your cue to say yes. Alright. Alright. Well, we already know Fuyuhiko has the prize. That's that's just that's just a that's just a given. Hey Angel, yes. Can I help you? Not coming out, huh? Can't stay up thinking about Fuyuko too, but I think it's better if we investigate my hero's cottage for now. Where's her cottage again? Aha! Uh -huh. The door looks unlocked. <laughs> Moving after you're told to be third race, so I made sure to be one step ahead. However, removing what's inside is a huge no-no. There are no, there are others who want to investigate too. And somewhat pleasant smell wafting through the room. Proves my hero was here. But she's not coming back. Um, and should I see? try looking for a naughty book? Why? Yep. Now, now, I was only kidding. Kidding? What? Are you that kind of person? At least don't feel nervous anymore. So could that be the reason she see? said that? But it looks like we don't need to search for it. Check out the thing on the top of the bed. Top of the bed. Pog. Mana coins, Pog. It was Chiaki's a whole snack. Bro, you miss her in the bathing suit, bro. Miss her in the bathing suit. Hey, hey. Could it be? This might be it. The Enterprise Monokuma gave her the perfect person to beat that game. What's inside the envelope? Yo, a sob will stop, bro. I turned over the envelope and what came falling out was a few photos. This photo. This is... Oh, shit. This is... Ah, oh, here comes the memory flows, bro. Here comes the memory flows. Just like that game. It was a similar scenario to the first, during the first day in Twilight's True Edition. Girl B was in a bad mood because Girl A was late. And Girl D tried to cheer up by talking her picture. Back. Hey, what's up, JT? Fell asleep again? Hey, it'd be like that. Look at this photo, too. Broken face. It's the same photo Girl B showed Girl E on the third day? As I recall, Broken Face was in the classroom next to the music room. It's still. So it was more shocking. As Chiaki showed the photo to me, I was stunned into silence. Leave again? Yo, 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 no. That's Sonia? Oh shit! Mm. There's actually a photo of a dead body. And there's a piano behind the body. It looks like the music were past the case. Oh. oh wait. The one they blamed on a pervert. Bo, that actually that may be. No, yeah, that's No, that's that's Fuyuhiko's sister. I can tell because of the blushes. That's probably part of the clan shit. That's not Sonya. It had to be. One more, this is the last photo. Probably the photo of girl Ishii got killed on the fourth day. And that's gonna be me hero. We have nearly matched the body of the game. See? That's no mistake, this is a photo of girl E. As a Dongle Robo fan, I must ask, who did you date in DR1? I didn't I didn't actually max anybody anybody out in Dongle Robo 1. 
Uh, I didn't get to that, but I would have. I would have dated uh, Celeste. And in this one, I'm trying to go for Pekka. What's up, KG? But don't, yeah, don't spoil anything for me because this is the first time I'm playing through it, so much appreciated. Not high school, let me guess the trio of three males did it. I don't think so. So based on all these photos, it's pretty clear this is the ending prize. But yeah, it's Celeste in the first game and then Pekka in this game. This is the ending prize for being Twilight and what's depicted in these photos. Proof that Twilight syndrome murder case is based on an actual murder. Does that mean that stuff about our memories being stolen? Huh? What's this? Is it something else? See? There's a note inside the envelope. Try playing Twilight Syndrome. After you get a game over, press down five times for the real game. Once you do, you should remember what you did, what you all did to my sister. We'll talk then. Just no. Wait. I mean, the first person to beat the game and receiving the end prize wasn't Mahiru. Someone else said this to Mahiru, and that person is the one who actually received the ending prize. Mahiru wasn't just lured by Nagito, she also received the assembly. Yep. And that's why she played that game, right? I'm like, who writes this stuff? This envelope looks familiar. I cannot think of anyone other than him. Yeah, I'm glad we came to investigate because we did that. We discovered a very important clue. Yeah, I agree. Not much time left. I need to hurry. Yep. So we came here to investigate because we did discover a very important clue. Uh, let's see if Fuyuhiko will talk to us. I don't think he will, but we'll see. Hadrian <laughs> Chiego, what a coincidence. That something happens twice, third times the chimes, at least. You stalking or something? No, no. Don't say that. I was just thinking about filling you in on the rest of my investigation. You find that? I'll let you know if you drop your knees and lick my shoes. I was asleep what I missed so far. Cams. I'm sorry to say, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry to say. You'll find out, bro. Actually. What's about the footprints? Kill at the footprints in front of the beach house, right? You find out whose footprints those are? <laughs> if you want to know, I highly recommend you come to the beach house with me. With you? Of course, you'll come with me, right? What are you going to do, Chiaki? Mm. I'm going to try and talk to Fuyuhiko and see if he can tell me anything. So, so I'll leave this to yeah. you. Yeah, it's definitely a good idea. If someone like me tried to talk to him, it'd be impossible. It might be different with a girl. Just be careful that he doesn't get rough with you. Yeah. I guess this is where we part. I'll see you later, Hajime. What? Did you actually hear wanting her to stay? Ashley, what do you mean? Bye now. Let's go. I'll go on ahead on the beach house and wait there. Jiren! I want him to find out! Damn it! Uh, where am I going? Beach. Beach house right here. Ain't no fucking way. Yo, what's up? What's up, my? Hit with the one sign. Gundam. So I was right, huh? What I already assumed you would come here. Fine. I don't think you can hide from me, the Supreme Overlord who is the four dark divas of destruction. What's up, though, mind? Thus, I know everything, for instance, I'd have to know your feed. I can see you it. were preoccupied with your infamous beach play. Nature, it matters not, for what I love is silence world. and solitude. That's right, that's it, precisely it. I see, so I wanted to be invited, too. Aw, Gundam wanted to be invited, bro. Don't tell me you actually like big titty gamer girls. Let's go around to the other side. Here we go, cams. Now then. Let's go try and go in inside. All right, cams. Nagito. Why the hell are you here? Hello there. Oh, hello there, Kazuichi. Thanks for going easy on me earlier. Thanks to you, I was able to walk away with just mild bruising. You clearly think I like an ultimate. What the heck? This bastard. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> big news. Big news, I've discovered something very terrible. Terrible discovery. Not only that, I believe this is this is nothing like Sonia, but there's something I noticed too. <laughs> this is great. It looks like the investigation is reaching its boiling point. I'll just 
She got bonked on the head, bro. I even found out after listening to everyone's story at the airport, I went to a certain place. Well, it's probably better to say I snuck in <laughs> to everyone's cottage. Everyone's cottage? Yeah. Told Monokuna I need access for the investigation, so he simply let me in. That bastard, he did something shady again. Now then. Why did I do something like that? Well, I'll explain my reasoning to you. See? Come on, Azure, take a look. After I went through all the trouble of gathering all this, those footprints. So the reason you snuck into inside everyone's cottage. Yep. That's right, I want to get a sample of everyone's footprints. Nah, fuck this game. <laughs> I couldn't complete it. <laughs> Guess it's no big deal. It seems there's all this the footprints robbed of this person. Yep. Yoko Sionji. Yoko? Well... To be honest, the reason I summoned her to the airport was so I could lure her out of the cottage. She shut herself inside her cottage, remember? She stayed in there, she couldn't sneak perhaps. in. Perhaps. So I figured if I lured her out, she wouldn't be about to hurry back to her cottage. Holy shit, he measured everyone's feet. Yeah, that's kind of creepy. <laughs> Once I collected, there was a smaller... There was smaller than anyone else in the master footprints at the beach house. There's no mistake, these are Hyoko's footprints. Um, so it's not like I was snooping around or anything, but I found something really interesting at her cottage. See? Not a lot of these candies inside her room. That's... They're gummy candies that come in four different flavors. Strawberry, melon, grape, and orange. We got her from the supermarket. Apparently she really likes the brand of gummies. Have you seen the anime? I have not seen the anime, no. I've only started playing these games not too long ago. I've only watched the animes after I'm done with the game. <laughs> people like that sometimes. There are always people who will eat the same brand even if it's just potato chips. What's wrong with that? Well, it's not clear if this relates to the incident, but I thought I should tell you just in case. Coming in from this guy, that means it probably greatly relates to this incident. I see. Who parts are connected? Okay. Good. Theoka says she loves gummies, and there's a gummy on the floor right here. I think it's a gummy candy, but why is the candy go listen to the floor? That's weird. Plus, is it really okay to think it's just been carelessly managed? I don't know why, but I feel like it's sort of a little suspicious. Move her bog to I want the smoke. We'll find out, bro. We have, we have two suspicions. Is that a Hyoko or Fuyuhiko? I think it's Fuyuhiko. Oh yeah, that's right, we gotta talk to Sonia. She said she found something. I had big news. Huge, huge news. What's the big news? See? Remember the Sun Witch Esper Edo mask that was next to Mihiro's body? Oh, the mask the killer used to hide their face? Listen. No, that's not it. Correct. The mask was not it just used to hide their face. What was it for? Well? Sparkling Justice. Huh? Sparkling Justice is skill. Oh my god, we're gonna have another Genocide Jack incident? Ah, oh, here we go. Hold on, give me two seconds. I had to turn on my stove. Yeah, it's it's I it's not. I feel like what happened was Mihiru and Hyoko came here together. Cause Hyoko's not gonna kill Mihiru because she was the only one she liked. So I think what happened is that Hyoko got nervous or scared or something and hid in the closet and dropped a gummy. And then after it was all over, she kinda bolted. Cause they said it started it happened at three. And that's when me and Soda got to the... That's when me and Soda got to the, um, diner. Fuyuhiko Fui left before 3. Well, he left around 3. He just vanished. And so, I think he was in the closet, and then bolted afterwards. You wear a hero mask at all times, supposedly? They're a serial killer who really murders other criminals. You all look so disappointed, Ajime. You need to be surprised. Hey. The Sparkly Justice character, that's the serial killer you were talking about before, right? I'm sure the mask we found is a hero mask, but it's a heroin mask, to be precise. So much Esper is for as a pretty witch girl. Yeah, heroin. Anyway, so you're saying it's possible this killer is the one who killed my hero? Which means there's a serial killer hiding among us. I'm pretty sure I've seen a twist like this in some video game. Yeah, me too. 
stupid. Serial killer, my ass. The killer just used it to cover their face. That's weird. Even so, they sure chose something that stands out. That might be true, but. However. Oh, it's easy to write this off as foolish. It might be the best if we exercise some caution. Tell me everything you know about it's called sparkling the justice. The light of justice shines upon my mask. I expose the hearts of malevolent evil. Well. Justice complete. The center of justice that is pierced by justice. The lead star of justice that shines in the night sky. That would be me. Sparkling justice. What the heck was that? Well. And the sparkling justice catchphrase. What? I don't know. Serial killer has a catchphrase. Do you have a minute? I read it in a magazine in the library. There's only one ever person, a journalist, who was interviewed sparkling justice. The article was written in their native language, so I tried translating it. However... If never mind, so shut the fuck up. <laughs> no good can come from getting involved with a serial killer. Bro, this is another Genocide Jack incident. The serial killer might not want to hear that from you. I know how this all is about sparkly justice. Thanks to the math, nobody knows their true age or gender, making them a very mysterious individual. No, it does not mean they are in our group. It's possible the serial killer was lurking on this island all before they decided to murder my hero. Wow. That's probably not possible. I... That's the only thing I can think of. I mean, no matter how much I can think about it, I simply cannot believe it. That uh... one of us is capable of committing such a horrible murder. No matter how much I think about it, I simply cannot believe it. Fuyuhiko. I really think it's Fuyuhiko. And you understand Sonia's feelings about it. It's highly unlikely there's a serial killer hiding on this island. Alright, now what did Mikon to discover? You got something to say too, right? Well, compared to the others, what I have to say isn't that important, so please don't get your hopes up and be disappointed. I get it, so just get on with it. I tried my best to perform the autopsy, I was able to find out. My hero was definitely killed by a blow to the head. He was struck from behind by one blow. Based on the scar, the weapon is clearly the metal bat. But every dark cloud has a silver lining, as they say. Uh, it looks like my hero didn't suffer. What does that mean? No doubt that she died instantly. Death was instant. Sounds a little strange. I think I'd better remember that. There's another thing I found. Sorry, I'm talking on my own. Are you busy right now? I just saw your DM. I had a theory, but I don't think you would like it. Bro, if it's something about Pekko, I don't want to hear it. Uh, during the autopsy, oh. I was going to tell you in person, but I couldn't find you, so I put this in your mailbox. About what we discussed earlier, it is okay if we change the place and time. I have no more theories. I want you to come to the beach house on the second island at 2.30 p.m. Seems there's someone who wants to interfere with our meeting. Let's keep it a secret and tell them. Let's shine out to see each other for a while. Be bad, they started suspecting us for no reason. Hiyoko Sayoni. <laughs> that is real, it would mean Hiyoko met up with Mahiru, right? Plus, Mahiru's estimated time of death was around 32 3. They met 30 minutes prior. If you think about what implies that, man. I'm starting to get confused. It's true, what does it mean? What happened between Mahiru and Hiyoko? No, I don't think, I don't think it's Hiyoko either. Oh, and here it is, Cams. Bro, I don't I don't think it's Hyoko either. Like I said, I think they met up at 2.30. They were talking. Hyoko went to the closet to go get something. And he heard, she heard the door open, so she stayed. And whoever it was bonked Mihiro on the head and left. The time for unparalleled hedonism has come to an end. Come, the hospital. Now then. Looks like it's time. I guess the investigation's over. So it's finally starting the class trial where our hopes the killer would finally clash. <laughs> it's alright. Either way, I hope we will win in the end. Alright. Now then, let's go prove it. <laughs> what is he so excited about? No reason to respond to a guy like that. Anyway, we should start heading over. With the trial field where Monokuma is waiting, I have a ticket. Okay, there's there. no escape. And no choice but to press forward. And let us go. Please, it's not Pekka though. No way. As long as Pekko survives one more class trial, bro, I, I can I can max her out, bro.
I don't even know. All right, everybody's here. <laughs> Let me go, help me. He's gonna do something crazy to me, it'll be ruined. Why hey, you? shut up and stay put, you stubborn little lolita. Stop harassing little girls. What's going on? Jeez. Hyoko's trying to run away, so Monokuma brought her here by force. But Hyoko's still trying to run away, so Monokuma trying to wrap her to full Nelson. If you don't stay put, I'm gonna make you part of the island's food chain. Unbelievable. Making me waste my sweet ass time. Any guesses on how this trial will go? I feel I feel like the two the two main suspects right now for me are Hyoko and Fuyuhiko. <gasps> what the heck is Fuyuhiko? The guy he totally ditched. He totally ditched my appointments. He pisses me off. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm right here. Uh huh. Came, I was worried about you. <laughs> There's nowhere for me to run anyway, so no matter the ending, I have to accept it, right? But still, Bastard. I'm a Yakuza, accepting defeat is not an option. What does that mean? Hmm. Well, it's all good if you try to eat up, it's all good. Yo, buff on a Kuma. Anyway. Yeah, everyone's here, so let's See depart. Ya later. This is bad. I'm not mentally prepared yet. Like. Show some spirit! You don't have enough power harness, you're late in energy. Come on, bring out that energy! Well, I really do think it's for Yuhiko now. After what he just this said. This too must be the will of causality. Bro, Gundam, please survive. <laughs> please, Gundam, survive. Now then, let's keep our spirits high so we can one day find that shiny hope. That's right, I can only. Moving forward is our only option. That pigtails girl in Dungaropa. What are you talking about, Celeste, bro? Nah, bro. Celeste didn't deserve us, huh? I love Celeste. Let it be a mofo I hate. Let it be. You are so evil. Somehow I moved my muscles stiff from our nerves and uncle we walked onto the escalator. I mean, Soda's always a victim, or always a suspect, too, because he got there. One big sound filed the room and surrounding the space began to fall. I'll just watch you despair. Yo, shut up, KG! I was fluctuating between feeling and despair. So my heart was run, fruit swelling in the sun before it goes squish. Consciousness began to fade from the pressure. I tried to endure the pressure by firmly standing on my legs. I've missed four hours? So, the redhead died, Kite. So that's where we're at right now, the redhead died. And then it stopped altogether. This is the final chapter, game over <laughs> after. Aw, oh, shit. Defeat the boring routine. So... I've decided to start redecorating, so how's it look? Mr. Kama's, Mr. Monokuma's redecoration is awesome, isn't it? Impossible! Wendy's dead, yeah, Wendy died, bro. It's not like I'd allow you to think otherwise anyway. Go out of the trouble doing something like this elaborate, really. What is your true intention? No, no! Intention, but this killing aim is just to kill time anyway. <sighs> kill time? Yeah! To break away from my purpose, that alone is my purpose. Like... I, a purpose is only gonna be a weakness. Those who have purpose are always the weakest ones in a bunch. That's why you guys should forget about such cheap-ass purposes like trying to survive. <laughs> Thank you.